boom what's going on tubers it's your boy r k 0608 what are you saying mate eight eight on the same day guys i'm a massive spurs fan tottenham hot spurs um and they've sold gareth bale for 85 just under 86 million guys um a record buy for real madrid can't complain we also not lost the north london derby to arsenal but in regards to the money we got back, fantastic money, guys. But back onto a topic subject, we're looking on our fishes. Um, I've done a successful water change. Um, no casualties, I'd just like to inform everybody, no casualties at all. Everyone's looking fresh to death. Um, just want to update you on my peely, which I received from Patricia. Getting bigger, Patricia. Um, sickly cross 1993. As you can see, the black bits are near enough all off on the fish. Um, and the pearls in that bitch are looking ridiculous. Um, I've also got my update for my flower horns that I promoted from upstairs, looking fucking fantastic. I mean, the size of these things, when I first got them to now, ridiculous. And I mean, from the same batch, I got this one, which kind of looks like a, um, a, a red dragon, to... I be on my suit and tie shit, tie shit, woo! Um, from the same litter, looking fantastic, growing fast, guys. Um, this is one of my peelers, again, from upstairs, who's developed a couple of pearls on that bitch! Yeah, um, I wouldn't say it's the most fantastic of looking of fishes, but at the same time, very different. You know, how many people can say they've got a fish like that in their fish tank? Um, probably not, but at the same time, you know, it's still looking nice. I've got my first uh, Red Texas Akuma peeling slowly. I've got my yellow jacket. Guys, yellow jackets, I, um, or, you know, you get some that are called false yellow jackets. I bought this one, this one's called a, a yellow jacket, which I think is a, it's something like, is it a thread something it's from the parachromas family um i can't remember the exact original name of it but it's absolutely grown big i'm grand fond of it um it's getting its stars and stripes in there handling itself competing with the rest of uh, pandora's box doing well um i got my um beautiful texas i hope this one can replicate the one that died my my big giant male um doing well in that bitch um, Venom, guys i just want to update you on Venom. i mean i i see a lot of um uh, red devils um, and I see a lot of kind of Midas's. But when I bought this in Dillywood, this was um, sold as a Trimac Cross Midas. And I don't know what you think, guys. Like, looking on the shape of it, it's got a Red Devil feel to it. But I've, I think the actual rope, not the robustness, but the, the, the mass and the girth of this fish is very scary. I mean, the, the power and, and velocity that this fish provides when it's fighting with other fishes is ridiculous. I've never seen nothing like it, but it's a, such a nice species. Guys, if you haven't got a Red Devil in your tank or a Midas, probably Midas is a better, I feel. You need to get one, guys. They're, they're strong, they're big, they're, they're, um, they're, they're tough. You know, very hard to sort of um, to kill, if that makes sense. And they're a beautiful fish, very intelligent. And when they actually find their partner, they stay with that partner, which I read on the internet, which is really fascinating. I like that. I like that loyalty level within the fish. Um, going on to where we got our Louisiana. Um, from the Perichromis family, um, a little bit different to the you know, the jacket, um, as you can see. But this one's um, it's growing, guys. I got this one with my Grimoli, and my Grimoli unfortunately died. But this one's actually um, competed well, um, and it's actually growing, guys. And it's probably one of my strongest ones in the tank. I've got Spartacus in the background with his biatch. Um, I've got my convicts in there taking um, hostages, three of them. I don't know who the male and who the girl is, but they do like to, you know, from time to time lay eggs. Um, but yeah guys just showing you an update on Pandora's box I'm going to just drop off a little bit the next generation are growing guys um, you know sometimes I question myself when's the last time you bought a fish um, Romario Cade no 608 when's the last time you actually went to Dillywood or went to Castle Quags but guys I think sometimes you've got to invest in the youth you know you've got a small fish you pay for all the fish food like I've got down here and you know you feed him with water changes and you will get a big fish you know don't don't feel like you have to rush into buying a big fish it is nice and it feels good sometimes having that big galactico in your tank but sometimes guys with the right water ch uh, water changing in the food these motherfuckers do grow anyway guys i'm boring you big up to the sigla community doing your thing holla at your boy dips it hey look at it look at the pearls on that bitch look at it Respect it. Alright guys, hold out your boy. Dips it. Eight. Hey.